Hello, this is Capital Luxury. Welcome to this channel. Keep watching if you want to hear more. If you're in the market for a new timepiece, you're in for a treat with this video. The watches we're about to unveil may just captivate you enough to make a bold move. Rolex has undeniably had a remarkable decade, transitioning from a mere timekeeping device to a coveted symbol of status and a shrewd investment opportunity. Recently, Many Rolex models have been fetching prices below their official retail values. Today, we'll delve into which models represent smart investments at present, but may not offer such lucrative deals in the foreseeable future. We'll pinpoint the specific models undergoing price adjustments and provide insights into their implications. Whether you're a seasoned collector or just entering the Rolex arena, this discussion is essential. And if you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Hit that subscribe button to stay abreast of our future insights. First on the docket, let's delve into the Rolex Datejust. The smooth bezel variants are catching the eye particularly those with top-tier dials in sophisticated shades like Blue, Mint, and Wimbledon, or those boasting unique motifs. Smooth bezel iterations are becoming increasingly scarce, with rumors swirling that some may face discontinuation soon. Priced between $7,300 and $7,150, excluding those sporting the Oyster Bracelet. However, if you're eyeing one as an investment for resale, don't bank on significant profits. While these high-end dial models exude exclusivity akin to a VIP lounge, they're unlikely to soar in value like a rocket ship. So if you're acquiring one, it's likely more for the love of horology than a quick financial gain. Next, let's navigate the terrain of the Rolex Explorer series. The 40mm model, priced at $8,300, isn't showing promising resale value. Similarly, the 36 Aminer version's price might soon dip below retail. Transitioning to the Explorer 2, particularly the 42 Amimer Polar model, it's a reliable timepiece, but the black version's value has waned. While some older models in the steel and gold range retain their value, newer iterations like the Champagne version aren't faring as favorably. Overall, if you're investing, tread cautiously. If you're purchasing for personal enjoyment, these fluctuations might not perturb you. Now, on to the Rolex GMT Master Range. After commanding prices above retail last year, some models are now hovering around or just below their list prices. The Root Beer model, for instance, is closely aligned with its retail price, but vigilance is warranted as it could soon dip below. Similarly, the GR and R edition is teetering near the upper limits of its list price, so if you're considering one, keep a keen eye on market trends before making a move. Transitioning to the Rolex day date, unfortunately, the black dial variant finds itself in a precarious position. The newer 40mm version, boasting enhanced features, commands a price of $88,000, but its resale value may soon plummet below retail. Likewise, the James Cameron edition of the Deep Sea range has been hovering around retail due to market dynamics. If you're contemplating a purchase, monitor trends closely. Prices may fluctuate in the coming months. Let's now discuss the Rolex Daytona. Various iterations, including those crafted from yellow gold, are experiencing price hikes, particularly those adorned with diamond-studded dials. The yellow gold model, affectionately dubbed Pikachu, is particularly sought after, presenting a solid option for resale. If you're eyeing potential profits in the gray market, these models merit consideration. Delving into the Sky Dweller range, some steel models are priced around retail, suggesting minimal profit margins for resellers. The steel versions, including the black model on the Oyster Bracelet, may soon dip below retail. Despite the aesthetic appeal of the Jubilee Bracelet, don't anticipate a significant boost in value. The market currently reflects a laid-back demeanor with lukewarm prospects for profit. As we conclude our exploration of Rolex models and their current market dynamics, it's intriguing to shift our focus to another realm of horological fascination, the world's most extravagant timepieces. These luxury watches, often adorned with rare diamonds, intricate complications, and unparalleled craftsmanship, represent the epitome of opulence and refinement. From historic timepieces steeped in heritage,
to contemporary marvels pushing the boundaries of haute horlogerie, let's embark on a journey into the realm of horological extravagance and explore the timepieces that command astronomical prices and capture the imagination of connoisseurs worldwide. Which are the most expensive luxury watches in 2024? Graf Diamond's Hallucination. Price, USD 55 million. Crafted by British jeweler Graf Diamonds, the Hallucination has held the top spot as the most expensive watch in the world since 2014. Designed by Lawrence Graf, the chairman of Graf Diamonds, this timepiece is more than just a watch. It's an embodiment of extravagance. Adorned with a collection of 110 karat multicolored diamonds on a platinum bracelet, the Hallucination is a fusion of haute couture and horology, sure to captivate onlookers with its dazzling display of colors and cuts. Graf Diamond's Fascination Price USD 40 million Introduced in 2015, the Fascination is another masterpiece from Graf Diamonds. With a body comprised of 152.96 carats of white diamonds, this timepiece stands out among premium luxury watches. Its centerpiece is a rare 38.13 carat pear-shaped white diamond serving as the central dial. What sets this watch apart is its detachable pear-shaped diamond which can double as a ring, adding versatility to its opulent design. Patek Philippe Grandmaster Chime Price, USD 31 million. Patek Philippe's Grandmaster Chime, a pinnacle of horological craftsmanship, is renowned for its dual dial feature. Sporting blue opaline dials with gold-applied numerals and 18K solid gold dial plates, this timepiece offers five distinct chiming modes, an acoustic alarm, and a date repeater. With only seven pieces ever produced, its exclusivity adds to its allure, making it a coveted treasure for horology enthusiasts. Breguet Grande Complication, Marie Antoinette. Price, USD 30 million. Commissioned by an admirer of French Queen Marie Antoinette, this timepiece is a testament to meticulous craftsmanship. Crafted over 40 years by Abraham Louis Breguet, the watch features 24 complications, including a perpetual calendar, a minute repeater, and a Westminster chime. Despite its historical significance, it remains a marvel of engineering, earning its place among the most expensive watches in the world in 2024. Jaeger Le Coultre Joaillerie, 101 Manchette, price USD 26 million. Crafted as a gift for Queen Elizabeth II in 2012, this masterpiece from Jaeger Le Coultre boasts a bracelet made of white gold adorned with 576 diamonds and 11 onyx gemstones. Housing the miniature caliber 101 movement, one of the smallest mechanical movements in the world, this watch is a testament to the brand's mastery of craftsmanship and elegance. Concluding with the Yachtmaster 40, steel versions with platinum bezels offer limited profit potential. The steel and rose gold combination, despite its allure, may soon dip below retail. While these watches exude style, they may not yield immediate resale profits. In summary, the prevailing market trend warrants caution, especially with entry-level models, as prices often stagnate or decline shortly after purchase. However, if a timepiece resonates with your style, seize the opportunity to make it your own. Share your thoughts on these insights in the comments, and remember to like and subscribe for more discussions.